Hey, this is another Unity ML Agents tutorial. If you've trained your agents and you're trying to figure out how to actually use that in a game or an application, then I'm gonna show you how to do that in this video. Uh, this is actually a sample from a follow-up to my previous tutorial where I do a complete walkthrough and we're training truffle pigs how to find truffles. Uh, but the steps are exactly the same. So if you've trained your own project and you're just trying to figure out how to run inference, this is the video for you. The first thing you need to do is find your .bytes file. In this case, it's in the folder where I've done my training, and it shows up under models. And I've done a bunch of training here. So in this case, I would pick maybe my most recent one, or maybe I knew that one of these was better, pull that out, and I need to take this .bytes file and import it into Unity. So I like to just click and drag sometimes, but there are other ways to import. Once you've done this, in this case, I don't actually know that this was the best training that I've done. In fact, I, I'm quite certain that this is the best training. I'll show you how to actually use one over another. You have to first open up this in your inspector and you can set your model here. So I could set it to this one or this one is what I'm gonna leave it at. You can also delete it and then it won't have any to use, but I'm gonna put this back in. And then you go to Academy, you make sure that under Broadcast Hub, you have the learning brain here unchecked because if it's checked, that means your, um, your training code is going to be controlling it or some external code is controlling it. This unchecked means let the, the brain do its learning using the model. And so you'll see here, if I press play, that it's using that model now. And this was something I had trained previously. 